Hi everyone, it's Ben here with you today. As you remember from our previous episodes, we've started a series of tutorial videos explaining the ecosystem's various details. Today, we're going to take you through why you need an Everscale account and how to set it up. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. This will help the growth of our channel. So let's get started. First, let me remind you, Everscale is a fast growing next generation blockchain driven by the ideology of decentralization. In addition to near instant transactions with minimal fees, Everscale offers a multitude of income opportunities within the blockchain. Before you dive into Web3 though, you should create your own blockchain account, which would mean getting a wallet address where you'll be able to store your Evers. An Everscale account is an Everscale address containing a wallet smart contract. This smart contract can receive coins from other wallet smart contracts, store and transfer them. You can transfer coins and tokens to any address, but if the smart contract is not deployed correctly, your coins or tokens might be lost. On the Everscale blockchain, the address of the smart contract deployment is not random, but is calculated based on the smart contract code and user data, such as public key. Therefore, different types of wallet smart contracts have different addresses. Some of the most popular Everscale wallet smart contracts are Safe Multisig, Setco Multisig, Surf, Bridge Multisig Wallet, Everscale ecosystem wallets are available on different operating systems, making them very handy. Thus, depending on your preferences, you can choose a desktop wallet, such as Eversurf, an app-based wallet on your smartphone or personal device, iOS or Android, uh, such as Surf Again, Everwallet or Everspace, or a browser extension wallet like Scale Wallet or Everwallet. Before we get into the details of creating an Everscale account, I'd like to say a few words about security, as this is highly important if you want to keep your funds safe. So, before funding your new Everscale wallet, it's important to remember that the seed phrase of 12 unique words associated with your wallet is the only way to restore your account. In addition to the above, when you create a new wallet, a set is generated that consists of a public and private key. The private key is used to sign transactions, in other words, transactions with your coins and tokens, and the public key is used for authentication. Now you're aware of smart contracts, ecosystem wallets, and security, it's time to move on to creating an account. It's straightforward, just follow a few standard steps that are the same for every Everscale ecosystem wallet. The setup of each of the wallet options involves the following standard steps. One, Download and install an application corresponding to your operating system, such as a smartphone, browser extension, or web version of the wallet. Select Create New Account. Read the decentralization policy and accept it. Create a PIN code or password for quick access to the wallet. Write down the seed phrase that's shown to you or find it yourself in the security stroke seed phrase options. Top up your wallet account with Ever. Activate the wallet. And that's it. Deploy this wallet smart contract to the address for further token management. It's a one-time process which is performed if there are funds on the balance of the wallet. Do kindly note that if the activation process has not been completed, you can only receive Ever to your balance, but you won't be able to send them. In the Eversurf wallet, activation is automatic and possible without spending your tokens with a D-Bot, so you get an active wallet almost instantly. Isn't that great? Other wallets have a deploy button that you use to deploy your wallet smart contract, i.e. activate it. When your account is registered and fully set up, you're ready to buy Ever to transfer them to your wallet. You have several options when it comes to buying Ever. You can use one of the centralized exchanges, such as gate.io, mexc.com, uh, BitMart will be listing on the 16th of May. Uh, please keep in mind that it's not safe to store your crypto on centralized exchanges as a general rule of thumb. So after buying, it's better to transfer your crypto out of the exchange immediately. As an alternative, you can use changely.com or go to optusbridge.io, transfer USDT from Ethereum, Polygon, or Binance Smart Chain to your account, and swap to Ever on flatcube.io, the main DEX of the Everscale ecosystem. Perhaps the easiest way to buy is directly with a credit card in Ever Wallet and Eversurf. Uh, these are popular Everscale apps that combine the features of a wallet, chat room, and DApps launch environment. Uh, if you check our previous videos, there are more info, and there's also a Surf Zone channel. 
Congratulations, you've created your own account and now you are a proud ever holder. You're part of a dynamic, fast growing and technologically advanced ecosystem. Thank you for being here and well, I'll see you in future episodes.